Euro dollar long-term forecast for the week of February 13th, FXEmpire.com. The Euro dollar continued to be the focus of the markets this past week as the Greeks simply cannot come up with the deal they need to avert the debt crisis that looms in March. The markets will rally every time there's a whisper of a deal in the rumor mills, but continues to get it disappointed. Ironically, the last time which was this previous week that we heard a deal had been reached, the reaction was somewhat muted. It looks as if the market is finally starting to get bored with the games coming out of Athens. The recent action has been pretty impressive, but has been predicated upon the market trying to get out in front of a deal in the debt crisis. If the deal doesn't come, this could collapse this pair. The market certainly will have been a bit overbought because of this, considering that even a few weeks later, we just don't have anything out of the Greeks in the Troika. In fact, it looks like a default is almost an inevitability given the uh, reaction of the Greek people as a whole. Uh, labor unions, uh, strikes, and the like have taken over in Greece, and even if the austerity measures do get passed, there is a high probability that uh, the next round of people to be voted in will be people who will be anti-austerity, and even if we do get this deal, it's very likely by the end of the year it'll collapse anyways. The 132.50 area is a 38.2 Fibonacci retracement from the most recent fall and an obvious uh, support and resistance area. We formed a shooting star, so the break of the bottom of the shooting star, and then in this case we would let it break below 130, would signal continued weakness uh, in our eyes. We would need to see a break of the shooting start to go long under most circumstances, but really we need to see 135 cleared because on a break of this, uh, the risk reward ratio just isn't there as the 50 percentile retraces about 134. Just simply far too noisy to go long. So of course we want to see 135 give way to buy. With that in mind, we are basically thinking sell only in this pair and sub 130, we will certainly do that.